Good morning and uh, welcome uh, to the San Diego New Central Library. Uh, it is great to have everybody here with us today. Um, members from the Library Foundation, uh, from uh, Mayor Filner himself, and members from uh, Mayor Filner's office, and of course, uh, members from the San Diego uh, Library. Uh, we, uh, we are so thankful to have you guys here, and we celebrate many things here at the library. We have a wonderful construction project behind us, uh, but we're celebrating something a little different today, uh, volunteerism. And so before I get into our guest of honor, uh, I'd first like to call to the podium for a few remarks uh, our mayor, uh, Mayor Filner. Welcome. I'm just here to thank the cookie lady, <laughs> Betty. Is it really Betty Bloomer? Is it really Betty Bloomer? We're going to make you into a character that, uh, that, that uh, supports this library, OK? Uh, you know, th this is an incredible building that's going up. And the people who are building it, we, 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 f we tend to forget about it as we look at the incredible architecture. And then, so, but Betty was looking across the street from where she lives. And she thought about the guys and gals who were working on this project. And she wanted to say thank you. So thank you, Betty, for saying thank you. I, I know everybody looks forward every Monday as you, uh, you bring the cookies. Although I heard there's a rumor. And I'm very upset about this, Ms. Bloomer. I heard there's a rumor that the construction schedule is falling behind because they want to continue getting the cookies. Now, is there any truth to that rumor? You've held up. So uh, they like it so much they decide to stay longer. They're but look, what you, what you have shown in just your, your act of generosity is showing that, you know, we have a community here, we have a community downtown, we have a community in San Diego. We want to thank those who are building these big buildings and, you know, we forget about the people as they build them. And you want us to remember them and we want to remember you. And so we want to make sure that you're remembered with uh, one of the bricks that we're, 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 we're doing to raise money for the thing, we want you to be remembered, Betty, because all of the uh, construction crew looks forward to, uh, to you every Monday morning. So thank you so much, Betty Bloomer. Thank you, Mayor Filner, and, and that could not have been um, uh, more perfectly said. You know, your volunteerism here has obviously uh, created such an impact on me personally, on this project, on every worker here. Uh, your commitment to what's happening here and um, has drawn this project into the community. And uh, you, we have embraced you as a part of our team. Um, we get so excited every week when we see you come in with fresh new goodies and uh, the, the teams out here are just as excited when we are able to walk those goodies onto the job site. Um, you've uh, increased morale uh, and you've given people uh, the feeling and the confidence that this community supports what's happening here. So we want to personally thank you on behalf of uh, the city, Turner Construction in particular. We want to thank you for your just an undying commitment. Uh, Betty said to me earlier that, you know, when you are, when you're volunteer, it's just in your nature. It's just something you do. Um, and so I'm sure you don't want the appraise, but we want to make sure you understand just how much what you've done has meant to us. And so we want to present you with a couple of things. Uh, firstly, we want to present you with some commemorative hard hats. Uh, that have your names on them because again you guys have just been a part of this project and in, in more ways than one. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to put it on? <laughs> and 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 yep says Betty Bloomer on it and Dick wow. Bloomer has one as well. And then, uh, and then also we, you know, we are doing these uh, commemorative, the commemorative bricks that uh, the Library Foundation is is uh, putting all over the project uh, to help raise funds. But we wanted to donate one in your name, uh, so you'll always have a, your place at this library. So here's your commemorative brick as well.
provide one for our family. But this one is going to help you take care Absolutely. Yeah. So that brick will be laid right here in the courtyard very shortly. So, but we want you to see it first, but that one's going in. All right. Okay. So now I want to bring uh, to the podium uh, the library director. This will be her new home here in a couple of weeks here. So uh, I'd like to welcome to the stage, uh, Deborah Barrow. Thank you so much. I am so excited as um, part of the San Diego Public Library. Betty is going to be a permanent, permanent fixture in our library. Not only is she just across the street, but she's going to have a brick here. And we expect to see her here at our library. She's our number one library volunteer. So we're excited. Um, volunteers in the San Diego Public Library, all 36 of our libraries, we have over 3,000 volunteers. And they save us about $1.3 million per year. So what Betty is doing is just the start. And we are so excited to invite others to volunteer at our library to help us continue the fine tradition of being a place for our community members to volunteer, to be involved, to be able to educate themselves and just exemplify the community spirit that Betty so finely exemplifies for all of us. Betty, I just want to say thank you. You know I'm a foodie, so I envy the workers here and all that they get, and I will definitely have a macaroon today, as well as a chocolate chip cookie, and who knows what else. Thank you so much. We really, really love you and appreciate everything that you're doing for our project and helping this be a welcoming home for everyone in San Diego. Thank you so much. So, but we want to give you an opportunity just to come forward if you have any comments you'd like to show. Oh, oh, I apologize. Jay's next. <laughs> uh, Mr. Jay Hill from the uh, San Diego Library Foundation. No problem. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. I'm uh, Jay Hill. I'm the CEO of the Public Library Foundation. And we're so excited to have you here today uh, to, to really thank Betty and, and also Dick. As Deborah said, they represent just one of the thousands of volunteers who make the library system possible. We would not be able to open up this building or any of our 36 libraries without the amazing spirit of the volunteers. And you're really seeing it personified today, but Betty is just one of the ranks of, of, of literally thousands of people who really make a difference day in and day out. In fact, I can tell you with this project, uh, it was a volunteer board of directors that raised the 35%, over $60 million that needed to make this project happen. It's unprecedented anywhere. And we have the most amazing volunteers here in San Diego, whether they are out there uh, raising money or baking cookies. And so we're, 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 we're very grateful for that. You saw the great brick that, that, that Betty has, and I'm excited to say that we have lots of bricks for people who might want to uh, purchase one. We have over 2,500 people that have honored their loved ones, and we'll have a brick inside the courtyard here. It's a great way to honor mom for Mother's Day coming up this weekend. And in fact, we have um, some great naming opportunities that, that, uh, that people have uh, honored their, their mother or loved ones. So we have everything from the bricks to auditorium chairs and rooms and everything like that. But mainly, I'm here to join everybody else and to say uh, thank you to all the volunteers and particularly thank you to uh, Betty and, and Dick Bloomer. I wish I was on the construction site myself so I could work off some of her cookies, but they're, uh, they're amazing. And Betty, you inspire us. Thank you. And so now we want to give you the opportunity just to share a few words uh, as a grandmother, a great-grandmother, as a, uh, a former critical care nurse. We know what your commitment is, but you have touched over a thousand uh, uh, people on this job site. And so we just wanted to give you an opportunity to share a few words, if you'd like. <laughs> <laughs> it's you whom I like to thank. You've made this neighborhood when we came here a home. It's a wonderful place to live. We bought property here in 72. We knew we'd come back. But volunteers, I'm 
overwhelmed. Never in my almost 90 years has anybody ever needed to say thank you. We volunteers get all the joy of it. We really do. What it gives us a whole focus of life. It makes us live longer and healthier. And, and it makes our people proud of us. My daughters and children haven't decided I'm a drag yet. They think I'm a VIP. And God love you. And thank you all so much. <laughs>